Today we're going to be cooking gluten-free crispy chicken goujons. Okay, let's get started. We're going to need some chicken. Um, you can either buy this as chicken mini fillets or a chicken breast and cut it up, which is what I've done today. If you're cutting it up, what you need to do is try to ensure that the pieces are reasonably close to the same thickness. What we don't want to do is cook this and find that some are really overcooked and some are undercooked. Going to need a couple of eggs, which we're going to whisk up. Going to need some breadcrumbs and some flour and some salt and pepper. I'm using gluten-free breadcrumbs and flour today because I want to make this dish as a gluten-free one. First of all, let's start. I'm breaking up the eggs. We'll just go those quick, quick whisk and combine the whites and the yolk. Then what we can do is we can season our flour. So we want a reasonable amount of salt and a good amount of black pepper. And then we can combine that together. Just give that a good mix up. I'm just using a small bowl of breadcrumbs and flour today. Obviously you'll need to judge for yourself depending on how much chicken you're actually cooking. There we go, so that's all nicely mixed together. You're going to need your fryer set at about 170 degrees. We don't want to go any more than that because otherwise what we're going to end up doing is just burning the outside breadcrumbs and the chicken won't be cooked in the centre. Okay, so if we take the chicken dip it in the egg mix we're going to go into the flour just press that down so it's nicely covered I'm going to go back into the egg mix let that drain off and then in to the breadcrumbs until that's nicely covered. And we can just lay those off to one side. So I'll repeat that for the rest of the chicken. Okay, that's all of the chicken nicely covered. So what we can do now is add it to the fryer. What we need to do, just lower it in and drop it away from you. Don't drop it towards you because if the fat splashes, it's going to hit you. Don't overcrowd the pan. Four or five pieces is about the most you'll want in there at any one time. And there we go, that's all in. That's going to now fry for about seven minutes. Okay, there we are, that's had about six or seven minutes. They've crisped up nicely and they've browned up nicely. I'm just going to lift those out into a bowl. 
bit of kitchen paper in, just to get rid of the excess oil. I tend not to use the basket in my fryer for things like this because the chicken sort of sticks into the holes in the basket and doesn't seem to float around freely. So I just use it in the oil as it is and move things around with a pair of tongs. But obviously this will depend on the size of your fryer. I'm just using sunflower oil here. Okay, let's move these to a plate and take a look. So there we have it, that's gluten free, crispy chicken goujons. If you've enjoyed this video and found it useful, please give it a thumbs up. Maybe you'd consider subscribing to the channel and hitting that notification bell so that you'll get alerts whenever I post future videos. Thanks for watching.